Hey, what's going, man? What's up? And welcome back to another one. We got another Call of Duty video for y'all, bruh. And we got, I saw that one of my favorite guns had got a slight buff that made it a little better, bruh. And that's the Holger, bruh. I started out using this gun, bruh, and it became one of my favorites, but it had, you know, got nerfed and it wasn't hitting no more. But I had, I took a little break, Call of Duty updated, and when I came back, bruh, I'm not gonna lie, it was hitting like it was the first time, bro. Like, it's gas. But if you want the loadout class for yourself, make sure y'all stick to the end of the video for that, bruh. And if you're excited about the Holger being back as I am, bruh, leave a little like on this video, and let's go ahead and get into this one. Occupation scan. Get on the ground or go underwater to avoid detection. Squad members are in the safe zone. Five are left. Stay sharp out there. Careful, area's hot. Movement here. Shot. Enemy destroyed. Use your tactics. 
back. I'm about to hunt down the rest of them. Careful, area's hot. Hard to keep a ranger down. Be advised, enemies deploy to fire station. is closing in. You made it to the top five. The safe zone is far from your location. Get moving, pronto. Enemy buy station incoming. Movement here. Moving this way. Enemy soldier incoming. Stop. The first attachment I used was the gauge nine mod module. The reason I use this one is mostly for the bullet velocity. I like, I like when my shots hit like hard for real and you know, from better distance and whatnot. And then we got the churro six match, obviously more damage range and stuff. And you know, a little bit with recoil. Honestly, in my opinion, the gun don't really got that much recoil if you got good aim. So you don't really need attachments for a lot of recoil and then here i use the phase three grip this deals with all the idle sway you know when the gun go up and whatnot recoil control it basically just makes the gun a laser so i like this attachment and then you know these two are all preferences but i think for the gun because i use this as like a mid-range to long-range gun so i think you should use this scope the coral eagle's eye for sure and the 40 round mag for the most round for and here it goes, testing it out. Feel me? Great gun, bro. Hits hard and it hits hard from distance, too. And you see it's a laser, so. It's two options in this world. Is you gonna win or lose? Is you gonna take the risk or not? You know you gotta choose. Yeah, I can't keep one, so all my bitches come in twos.